Okay, obviously, this is my very first video I've ever made. Wow, it looks really weird when you start recording. Anyways, um, I drive for Uber, and I started doing that to get me and my son on our feet after my husband was no longer in the picture. Um, I was very blessed that I actually have a Lexus ES series. We'll just keep it there at that. And it's all black, black interior, black outs, exterior, uh, leather, but it's 2005. So it doesn't qualify for the looks or the select. But I'm okay with that because from what I've heard, it's very hard to get people that even want to pay that much for a ride. So I'm fine doing the, the UberX and the Uberful, but I really prefer UberX, obviously. Um, I'm going to go ahead and tell you right now, Everyone should be signed up to drive for Uber, even if you're not going to do it anytime soon. I think everyone should be signed up and upload your documents. Don't put it off. It's very easy. You take a picture of them. Make sure it's clear. Make sure you can see everything that needs to be seen. And then they usually get back to you within like... Uh, maybe a week, two weeks at the longest. Because as long as you have a vehicle, you should be signed up for Uber, and here's why. You never know what's going to happen. You could get fired. You could get laid off. You could get injured, and you, maybe you can't lift a certain amount of weight. Um, and usually that's because you hurt your back. Or your knee maybe but usually it's back issues um, that happened with me at Home Depot some years ago but you can still drive so say you need something to do in the meantime and even if it's been a while since you drove for uber or say you signed up but you never did drive you may have to upload some new documents proving that your insurance is valid and all that license they do a background check. Um, I don't know how often they do background checks. I had a friend that drove for Lyft, and she said that she got chosen to do a random background check. And she had gotten, like, three speeding tickets. Yeah, that's my son. He's not happy. It's his bedtime, but he won't go to bed. It's probably not my fault for sitting here making a video. So, anyways, I can't believe I look this bad in my first video. I apologize. So, basically, Grady, stop! Grady, give mommy a minute, please. See what happens? I start talking about Lyft and he flipped out. It's just it's Uber. I tried, I tried Lyft, but I they obviously you have to have a newer model vehicle. So, anyways, um, so say you get fired or laid off or whatever, and you can't you can't work, but you can still drive. So you need extra income. So. Log on your Uber app, make sure all your documents are good, updated, and start making money just like that. And that way, and while you're in between jobs or whatever, you there's something that you can be doing making money to support your family or to pay your bills if you're single with no kids or just whatever you need money for. 
and it's something to do versus nothing and stressing over looking for a job and and finding a job and then I mean you might find that you love it and keep doing it full time but even if you do have a job and you, there's a bill you can't pay or you want some new clothes but you just can't quite afford it drive go drive on the weekend Weekend's a really good time to drive. I wish I could, but I can't because the weekend daycares are outrageous and overnight daycares are outrageous. Plus, there's like only one in Atlanta, and I'm not I'm not doing that. That's about, that's the only time with my kids. So, um, but I think everyone should be signed up, and that that's why you meet some really good people, um, and. <laughs> You can make money off the referrals. Most of it has to be that they have to complete so many trips within um, a certain amount of time. So, yeah, I'm going I'm to make this short, but I, that's why I think that everyone should be signed up. At least signed up, because that way... You can just get it in the app and go when you need extra money. I mean, it's worth it to me. College students, just whatever. So, anyways. Okay. I don't want to make this long. He's fl- he's over here flipping, so. Um, if anybody has any questions, comment. I'll get back to you pretty quick. And I'm also going to put my referral code in the description. Okay. I hope my first video wasn't too bad or I didn't pause too much in between sentences. I feel kind of like I should redo this, but I'm not going to. Okay. Hopefully I'll get some subscribers and watchers at least or maybe even one thumbs up all right <laughs> i got some really funny um uber stories to tell though so keep watching if you want to hear some like i'm talking about like in-depth in detail funny stories and since this is my youtube channel and i'm not actually like driving people around like i keep forget forgetting that like i can say shit and damn and cuss and how I really feel. I'm going to try to avoid the F word as much as possible because it just kind of sounds nasty sometimes, but fuck it. All right. Just keep watching. I got a lot of good stuff. This You love it. Okay. Peace out. Good night. Grady, say night. <laughs> She's so mad. Okay. Bye. <laughs>